Judy, what a team effort today. You must be very proud of the girls. Yeah, I am absolutely delighted and very, very proud of them. Um, it was a fantastic day. Um, I think a very tough match for um, Anne, first up. Um, very windy conditions, very tricky. Opponent who was playing very well, but she was very, very close. There really wasn't much in that one at all. Um, and uh, going into the second singles, one down, um, Bally really rose to the occasion. I mean, she is a true number one. You know, she knew she had to go out and get the job done, and she just went out and blitzed it. Tactically perfect, and fought her heart out, as she always does. And then our pièce de résistance, our kids, straight in there against an experienced Dutch pair who play very good doubles and they whooped them. Came from behind in both sets and I'm absolutely delighted. And so you're sitting on the sidelines watching all of this going through the mo all the motions. Is it a bit nerve-wracking? How are you feeling when you're sitting there watching all this unfold in front of you? It's, it's, it's a little, little bit nerve-wracking but the main thing is you're always sort of looking for what's happening and you know that kind of coaching side of it helps you to overcome the nerves I think a bit because you're always looking for what's happening what can I help them with at the next changeover what can I what should I be encouraging them to try to do but um, yeah we managed to get there in the end and it was yeah it was it was pretty hairy towards, <laughs> towards the end of it but I'm so pleased they got there and uh, what a fantastic game they played really. So it's really been the perfect start, two wins, two days, and then Israel tomorrow. Yeah. Um, another tricky tie for the girls. Yep. Um, your thoughts on that tie? Yeah, I, 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 it is tricky because they have a very strong number one. They have Shahar Pier who has been ranked within the top 20. Um, not that long ago, and is still one of the one of the best players in the world. So that that's that's a difficult one. Although she lost her singles today against the Portuguese girl, but um, the Israelis have had two very tough and very late finishes. Um, so I'm hoping they're going to be tired. We are very pumped and we're raring to go. And I don't see any reason why we can't get through that one tomorrow as well.